against Cardonians, number 21, by 49 of the series. One character succeeds this and Heraklion, a member of the same school who took his cue from Simon and Sartorius. He was an immigrant from Syria who came to Rome and appeared there at the wedge that he was as his own scourge and the scourge of his followers. For the human race is wretched when it leaves God's way and strays and has perished by separating itself from God's calling. The proverb for the dog attending to the reflection of the food it had in its mouth applies to, to people like this. Looking into a pond and thinking that the reflection in the water was larger than the food it, in its mouth, it opened its mouth and lost the food it had. So these people who had found the way and, the, and yet wanted to get hold of the reflection which had been formed in their imaginations, not only the nourishment which God had as it were gracious, graciously placed in their mouths but drew destruction upon themselves as well. Kegdo then lived in the time of peace of Hikinus, the dean in succession of the apostles from the apostles James, Peter and Paul. Since his doctrine partakes of the order Heresiarch's foolishness, it appears to be the same, but with him it, it is different and takes the following form. He too has proclaimed two first principles of the world and two supposed gods, one good and unknown to all, whom Kerdok has called the father of Jesus, and one of the demutes who is evil and no and no rebel, and has spoken in the law and appeared to the prophets, and often become visible. Christ is not born of Mary, and has not appeared in flesh, but since he exists in appearance, he has also been manifest in appearance, and done everything in appearance. And Kerdo too rejects the resurrection of the flesh, and repudiates the Old Testament, which was given by Moses and the prophets as something foreign to God. But Christ has come from on high from the unknown Father to put an end to the rule and tyranny of the world created than the mute here, as many of the sects have declared of course. As after a short time in Rome he imparted his venom to Marcion, and Marcion thus become his successor. Since this sect is just as delectable as at last, my remarks about it will be, be will be brief. And once again, it shall begin to refutation of Kerdo from the very things he says. From that, there cannot be two first principles at once is obvious. Either the, the two principles are derived from someone or whether one is a second principle, which the other is the cause and principle and principle of the second. So we shall need either to find a cause from the two, or find which of them, be, being the principle of the other in its cause, it, as it said, it does our minds, must be led back by every root to the one, a principle which is found to be the first, the source either of the second and both both, as I have shown. For the two, for the, but the two first principles cannot possibly exist at once, nor can the one, the one possible ones possibly differ from the other. For if they differ, there are two of them, but by adding up to two, they have become more than one. But since the one, the first number is required, two are subordinate to the number which is one and prior, the cause of two. For the two which come after the son after the number one or single first principle cannot be their own cause since the unit which comes first of all is always required. For if for if it for if it is apparent then that that the two are of one accord of mutually complacent and harmonious, with one of them consenting to the permanence of the other and the other rejoicing in its partnership with the first, 
what conflict is there between oh, the the two of them but if they are in but if they are in conflict and each is equal and each is equally as strong as the other then although Kai's came to do came to do away with the one he cannot be capable of destroying its its tyranny it will stand its ground and have the ability to struggle with invisible and nameable power on high and hold out and can never be destroyed the fool says that both of the law both of the law and the prophets belong to the inferior contrary principle but that curse belongs to the good one then why did the prophets make prophecies with typified Christ? Unless the power that spoke in the law, the prophets and the gospel and the gospels was one and the same, as he says, Lo, here am I that speak in the prophets and so on. And why did the Lord also in the gospel cry out, Had ye believed Moses, ye would have believed me also, for he wrought of me. And I could say a great deal about prophetics, just as Kerdo did to gather his own school when he spoke it up in the world at an evil juncture and led his troops astray. But I shall pass it by as well since I have destroyed it like a bambix of wasp, flying insects with stings that suddenly take wing and dart at us. With God's self evident with faith, the saving teaching of our Lord Christ, Jesus Christ who said, See ye be not deceived, for many false prophets shall come in my name. And with the teaching of the apostle who spoke of this false Christ, false teachers and false written, and one up and one us against them, and the and proceeding to the rest in our series, I shall give the description of the others.